What's up, guys? It's Jacques Slade, and I'm here with the post game at the ESPYs, where we will see some of the best athletes in the world. Of course, the ESPYs means that they're going to bring out their A game, so we set up a shoe cam to capture what they're wearing. Let's go check it out. So, Jeremy, there's going to be a lot of hard bottoms on the red carpet, but you decide to wear sneakers. Talk to us about what you have on and why. Well, these are the uh, Justin Timberlake Legend of Summer Air Jordan 2s, and the insoles say suit and tie, so I figured I'm going to put my suit and tie on for the ESPY Awards. What better way to uh, dress them up with a nice pair of suit and tie Air Jordan 2s? Put my whole suit on, man. I'm suited and booted. I'm ready to go. It's a nice day in L.A., Wednesday afternoon. I'm getting no better, man. I got some old old Gucci's, I guess you you can call them. They're a little scuffed up. I've had them for a little bit, but uh, I like them. All right, so Jarvis, so we had some people wearing hard bottoms, some people wearing just regular sneakers. But it looked like you stepped it up a little bit. Can you kind of tell us what's going on down there? Oh man, I got a little Christian Louboutins. Um, just for me, it was a fashion statement today. You know, come out and impress, and uh, you know, let the shoes do the talking. I'd say uh, with this suit, I didn't really have any choice to go uh, go without the hard bottoms. Um, it's definitely uh, not the typical shoe I'd wear, um, but it's cool. It's a cool change. She's got the Gucci's on. I had the yeah. seersucker, so I had to throw the bucks on. You can never throw uh, anything but bucks on with a seersucker. So a couple of guys are wearing sneakers. Would you ever consider wearing sneakers on the red carpet? Sure. I mean, this is the ESPY, so it's about sports. It's about style. It's about you know creativity. So yeah. Having sneakers on the red carpet is not, it's not out of place here. It might be at the Oscars, but it's not out of place here. What goes into choosing your shoes for like a night like this? Um, for me, it's they have to match and they're my size. There's very few choices usually. So <laughs> there's very few choices that match and are my size. So that's what goes into it. Yeah, so it's the ESPYs, and it's about, you know, sports. Uh, I felt like I wanted to do something a little more casual. This is not really my style. I'm more of like a, a double monk strap type person. Uh, but I wanted to wear sneakers. I don't really wear the air tie. I, I wore the air tie tonight, too. So I'm just going for it, man. It's the ESPYs. So, guys, it looks like they're breaking down the red carpet at the ESPYs 2015. We had a great time, talked to a lot of great athletes. There wasn't as many sneakers as I thought there was going to be. There was a lot of hard bottoms. But if we do have to crown a sneaker champ here today, it was definitely Jeremy Guthrie. He slayed it, wore the Jordan 2s from the Legend of Summer from the Justin Timberlake and Jay-Z Tour. Shut it down. No one in competition at all. So this is the ESPYs 2015. Hope you guys enjoyed it. We'll be back next year. I'm Jacques Slade with the Post Game. Styles over the last few years and this year is the most distinct yet. Let's start with the technology. Nike Basketball is using two systems that are new to the basketball category at Nike. One is Flyweave and the other is Articulated Zoom. Now for those that follow Flyweave, you'll know that the same technology was used on the Jordan 29. So technically, this isn't new to Nike, but it is new to Nike Basketball. The Flyweave process takes high strength woven textiles that can be designed in high resolution down